don't think we applied ourselves properly. I think it definitely Royal Leon was the better team. And then obviously one uh, once we considered the first goal, the second goal was a gift for them basically. Uh, you know, our, our error, the lack of communication, obviously, but um, we came in the half time, we came back out and we were much more positive. We played on the front foot. You know, so obviously, to take away the positives of this game is the way we ended the game. You know, and that's, that's the way uh, we need to apply ourselves on the first whistle. You know, uh, so it's a lot of positive uh, t- uh, things that came out in the second half. Much, much better application, much better intensity and much more balls in the box. You know, and uh, obviously the goal that, that we scored at the crucial time and then we go and give um, give them a relief uh, with the gift, you know, but that's the game, you know, if you're going to make certain mistakes like that. You know, some days we will we'll benefit from mistakes like that and some days we'll be punished from, from, from the mistakes that we make, you know, but um, I think, you know, in, in a nutshell, I think we'll, we have to take away the positives because we've got another game coming in on Sunday and then uh, we'll just take it from there. But um, yeah, difficult, difficult one, we'll go back and obviously have a look at, at what went wrong and then um, try and rectify whatever we can in the short space of time over the next couple of days and, and, and prepare for Pirates. Um, care to share on what was said on half time on the players because they came out as different team to what we saw in the first half. Yeah, I said to them at the beginning, you know, before the league started, that we can't come in half time and speak about application, desire, and passion, you know, and that is what you have to speak about. You know, when we come in in, in half time, we need to speak to to rectify tactical issues and the way we play in the game. You know, I had to I had to have a go with him about the application and the attitudes. You know, and the attitudes changed in the second half. And we saw the difference when the attitudes changed. So I'm, I'm, I'm hoping they learn because it's nice when it, when it happens to them and you experience these type of things. So sometimes when you lose games like this, obviously, you know, uh, people think it's uh, the, the, the score is not a reflection of the game. You know, if I really think about the two mistakes we made, had we not made that mistake, you know, it would have been a different story. But be that as it may, we have to take it on the chin. And, and like I'm saying, we have another chance on, on Sunday to rectify it and obviously uh, try and get a positive result for the moment. Uh, next up, you've got Pirates on Sunday, which, uh, what do you think is gonna, are you going to do to, differently to what happened in the first half this time? No, look, we're obviously going to take away, the, the takeaway from this game is obviously the second half. I think that's what you need to focus on and that's what you need to pride ourselves on. I think pushing up, you know, the youngsters who came in, uh, Tulani Mini, uh, Lutuli came in, uh, Aviwe came in, Diego came in, they all made a difference and they showed the hunger. You know, uh, so they're all young and they're all going to learn as we go along. You know, the, the more opportunities they have, the better we're going to become as a team. You know, like I'm saying, I spoke to some of them and already some of them in the first half I could see was nervous. You know, it's their first game it's at the stadium, you know, so some of them was very, very nervous. But second half they showed, you know, and obviously we'll go back uh, tomorrow and work on whatever we need to work on over the next couple of days, like I said. But uh, we have to take away the positives in the second half and apply ourselves that way on, on, on Sunday. Um, which areas you want to improve or you think needs an improvement going to the next game? Now look, obviously, like I said, the application, you know, the desire, the intensity we played in the first half was nowhere near good enough and that, that, that hurt us a lot, you know, so sometimes when you speak as a coach, you, you speak these things before the match, you know, and, 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 then, and then it happens and luckily now I can go back and say, guys, but I told you. You know, uh, the experience that, you know, and the attitudes change. Once the attitudes change, the whole complexion of the game change and then we'll be more than capable. You know, but it's a new team, like I'm saying, it's, it's a very, very new team. We had 16 signings. We're still trying to find the team chemistry. We're still trying to find uh, the perfect combinations of, 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 of what's going to work for us and what's not going to work for us. We are still yet to get a set starting lineup. You know, everybody's going to get a chance. The games are coming thick and fast, so you have to keep the, 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 the legs fresh. You know, I had to take Andile off because I'm thinking about Pirates as well. You know, so uh, Lutuli shared the load with him today. You know, Brooklyn Pochen pulled towards the end of the game. I had to, I had to save him, you know, uh, because it saved the legs a little bit. Uh, bearing in mind that we still have a game on Sunday, you know, so hopefully we can turn it around on Sunday and get a positive result. Thank you. Thank you.